I'm challenging you to make the Lord your treasure. Make him the focal point of your life and your purpose. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, lead not under your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him. I don't care if it's in the business world, if it's in the education world, if it's in the entertainment world, in the church world. Make him first paramount and prim the primal one, primary, primera, number one. And let everything revolve around him. In all, in all your ways, acknowledge Him. You say, well, there's some things I do I can't acknowledge Him. Then stop doing them. If God can't get glory out of it, all it does is harm you. It hurts you. It injures you. It holds you back. It retards your development. It, re, it, it, it just... It, it, you shackle yourself. And when you need to run, you know, you just don't run well in shackles. In all your ways, acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your, your paths. I, I want to be led by Him, don't you? Do, do you hear what I'm saying? I want to hear, I want to be in tune with Him, and I want to be used by Him. I want to be blessed by Him. And I want, to, when it comes all, when the, when the sum total is, if, if I outlive the coming of the rapture, if I don't outlive the coming of the rapture, and, so, and I'm, I'm, <laughs> RK's got me looking pretty. You know, Ender, Enders and Shirley, funeral home, you know what I'm talking about. When, when they got me looking good, I want it to be said, he loved Jesus. And he put Jesus before any and every human relationship to follow the Lord.